Well, this one's a little weird. Motorist has a close call at night with a large animal on all fours south of Park Falls on Highway 13. This is in Price County, Wisconsin, um, summer of last year. Observed on June 30th, 2018, at approximately 9.45 p.m., I was headed south on Highway 13, approximately two miles south of Park Falls in Price County, Wisconsin. It was dark with my headlights, uh, the only light source. Okay. South on Highway 13, two miles south of Park Falls. Okay. This is Park Falls. This is Highway 13, two miles south. Is it's in here somewhere. Um, yeah, there's really not much here. <laughs> there's, there's woods and uh, random terrain. Doesn't look very hilly, but uh, okay. So we get a idea of the location. It is somewhat remote. Looks like Park Falls, that area there is really the biggest town nearby. So, okay, that get, that gives it a little bit of validity, I suppose, because it is, it is in the middle of nowhere. Um, anyway, in summary, while driving at approximately 50 miles an hour, an animal on all fours ran in front of my vehicle, uh, left to right, east to west. Okay, I nearly hit the animal as it came within five feet of the front of my vehicle. My observation was only a split second, but it left a very big impression, mainly because it didn't make sense, as explained in the last paragraph. My wife was in a passenger seat, but was on her phone texting, and she only looked up because I swerved to avoid the animal. She never observed it. Harry and Brown, I did not see the head, mainly because it was slumped down on fours, and um, the fast speed it was moving. My dimensions are approximate from my viewpoint as the driver, uh, 46 inches high, 46 uh, inches long, torso, 92 inches or so, 7'6", uh, if standing. I took a tape measure and immediately took approximate measurements after arriving to my destination five or six miles away. Okay, so you were probably headed to fifth field there. That's about five or six miles away. Hmm. Anyway. Um, I've been vacationing in this area since 1975 as a child. Um, it was not a black bear, brown bear, or not indigenous to this area. It wasn't a deer, wolf, or coyote. With this in mind, I'm left with a lot of unanswered questions and quite possibly someone else saw this animal too. Also noticed the creature had very thick hind legs with long uneven hair, not fur, that was two to three inches long. Other witnesses, uh, a vehicle was passing by in the opposite direction. Um, there are, I guess, in this area there's been other sightings as well. It was about 75 degrees with a light rain the last two days were very hot 90 plus and it just rained very hard uh, before the above conditions this is um, Fahrenheit not Celsius when it talks about 90 degrees if it was 90 degrees Celsius you'd be dead but uh, <laughs> but I digress environment uh, the area has a slight rolling hills with plenty of woods with clearings uh, the North Fork of the Flambeau River flows through uh, Park Falls with plenty of other rivers, streams, lakes, and ponds in the area. Uh, Flambeau River should be that. Well, I mean, everything seems to match up. You know, in fact, uh, 13 is Flambeau Ave. So, I don't know. I just think that's weird. Uh, something ran in front of the guy's car. He got a, a, a good look at it. It was fast. He was freaked out because he's been there before, didn't know what it was. Um, I don't know. It's interesting. Interesting. Let me know what you think. Uh, if you think this is uh, legit or you think the guy is just nuts. Yeah, I think he probably saw something. So let me know what you think in the comment section below. 
I think is interesting. Thanks for watching. Have a wonderful day. And I'm out.